Teddy Atlas, and we welcome you to Boardwalk Hall at the famed Atlantic City Boardwalk in southern New Jersey for a much-anticipated main event. Each man comes into this fight supremely confident, expecting to deliver a W. Riley's making his way to the ring with such confidence. That is the look of a fighter who knows exactly what tonight's outcome will be. The Beast has got a target on his opponent from the moment he steps out of that locker room to every step he takes during this ring walk, you can see exactly what's in his scope. Round number one is now underway. All the talk is done. It is simply time to fight. He clinches when he gets to the inside. Be interested to see early on here how much an advantage there is with speed. Riley's full of it. He has blazing hands, Teddy. Can he keep it up all night long? I think he's going to have to. The professional's jab can do so much there. He used it well that time. Couldn't hit the elusive target with that straight right. A well-placed left hand up top. The combo lands upstairs. Oh, that uppercut got him badly. Riley's feeling the impact of that powerful hook. Pulls the trigger right away with the left hand after getting tagged himself. Riley's showing you that sublime skill right now with that two-punch combo. The Beast's knowledge of the game is showing through. Three ways to defend. One of them is to block. He did it there well. He missed with that headshot. Able to get away from that headshot with the block. He took a shot, but he gives one of his own. A left hand scores. He gives as well as he takes. You saw it on that exchange. He just missed that shot up top. So the round comes to its conclusion, and it's a round in which our man here, as he heads back, was really tagged pretty solid. So if you're the trainer in the corner, what's your approach? Well, you know, that's a great question. My approach is that I have to remind him that he's on common ground. He's probably gonna think he's in a place where he's never been before, but I'm gonna remind him, hey, remember you got hurt in the gym? And then give him something to correct the problem. You know, tell him some technical thing that he needs to hear. The professional's opponent's probably looking at him right now saying, wow, you're not changing anything up. You know, he got to a moment ago. And out of nowhere, things can turn like that, Teddy. Everything was looking good. Now it's looking bad for him. Well, that's exactly why, because nothing was coming at him. His opponent wasn't throwing back. He got a little lax, and he paid a price. Thought he had his target, but way off to the side with the uppercut. Accurate jab brings the right hand. Scores up top with a left. Comes right back with a shot of his own. 
What a great round this has turned into after doing the... Oh! Wow, crushing blow upstairs. from a big shot. Now he's got to have some big guts to move along. You're going to find out exactly what he's made of. Now there's the jab. The professional's blocking ability is doing well for him there. Good exchange. He fires back. Tried to land that upstairs and was off the mark. Hard to believe that they can keep up like that. One of those rounds that you just won't forget. Both guys able to land big punches on the other. Oh, in the old days, they'd be snapping one of those capsules under their nose, you know, smelling salt, ammonia capsules. It's not allowed anymore. They want to wake them up, get them together. Now you got to dump a little water on them, send them out. The beast sticking to what we've always known of him, Teddy. The, st the professionals stumbled back. There it is. Wow, is this good shot. What good stuff. He just scored the knockdown after being knocked down earlier. Joe, that's incredible. And the knockdown earlier actually set up this knockdown because his opponent, he got a little reckless, a little careless. Riley's back up on his feet. What will he look like in the next few moments of this fight? That's the big question. There's that southpaw jab in the left hand. He gets hit, but he gives it right back. Precision work with the left hand by Riley. Good return fire that time. Riley's doing a really nice job here. I mean, putting his punches together. This is what you're supposed to look like as an offensive fighter. Yes, it is, especially when you have a guy in front of you putting the earmuffs on. You know, you cover up the way that his opponent is. You're supposed to put them together. One or two of them. What a big shot. And he crashes to the canvas once again. He's gotten up before. What about this time? over fight is over the professionals night has ended early here unable to go the distance he couldn't rise up and beat the count The Beast is knockout ability cannot be underestimated. This fight had everything leaning decision. They were coasting along, then he ended it. Well, this one brings you.